Napa Valley, France, Spain, Italy, none of them had what it took to be named Wine Region of the Year. Instead, that title went to Lodi. Lodi. Mm -hmm. How about that? The honor comes from the publication Wine Enthusiast. So, how did Lodi win this year's title in the shadow of Napa Valley and while growing through a drought? Well, CBS 13's Lee Martinez is getting answers. This year, California dried up, water was restricted. They're all over in here. And hail pummeled buds. Lodi Vineyards not only came through it, but it's ending its harvest with the title of Wine Region of the Year by Wine Enthusiast. I may have 8 to 16 barrels for one variety, from Nebbiolo to Teraldigo, which are kind of oddball Italian varieties. My absolute favorite is Sangiovese. And one of the most enthusiastic wine producers is Jeremy Tredovic, who started his own winery just five years ago. This is one of the only places in California that you could start up a small winery, um, not having a huge amount of means coming into it, and really be able to start something that's eclectic. It, it's really a, it's a proving ground. Lodi's Wine Grape Commission wasted no time in toasting to Lodi's new status, and it expects big things to come for the region. I think Lodi is very much coming into its own, and people are starting to recognize it. Huge honor for something that we don't apply for. They found us. So how did Lodi nab the attention of the wine elite? Lodi is no longer just growing grapes. It's making wine, too. New wineries like Jeremy's started popping up. From two back in 1990 to 85 uh, today. And in Lodi tasting rooms, you're likely to get personal treatment. You find the owners and the growers and the winemakers still working their tasting rooms, and so it can be a very intimate experience. As a child, this was a small town. There wasn't a lot going on here. Now Lodi is poised to be a travel destination thanks to a good glass of wine. All right, big deal for them. The Lodi Wine Grape Commission already has advertisements and social media posts highlighting the wine region of the year title from Wine Enthusiast. And the chairman says there's not yet been a winner two years in a row, so their goal now is to have Lodi make history and defend its title.